morning everyone and welcome back to my channel if you guys are new here please do make sure to click that subscribe button and for all my returning subscribers welcome to another video by your ultimate fave i know i know it's my hair it's making me look like i'm blossoming really um if you guys haven't watched my last story time i got this hair from tt hair couture uh i did get it for it, i think it looks like like a 24 maybe at most 26 inch and i did get it at a reasonable price at like around two point something so make sure to check it out there on instagram i'll probably link them down below or link them up the video but anyway, this video today is something I am so excited to do. I've been wanting to do this for a hot minute now. And to finally get the opportunity to do this is really, really cool. Now, I've told you guys so many times how much I really wanted to work on my stomach area, work on my body this year. I let myself go over the past few years and a lot of it just had to do that. I was like in a bad mental space and also school and stress. So there were just a lot of contributing factors. So this year, I decided that one of the things that I really needed to work on was my body and I wanted to do it for myself. And um, I did uh, contact, I did want to find out other alternative ways of getting, of burning your fat without actually having to go under the knife. So like non-invasive procedures. And one of the procedures that I did look up was called fat freezing. Now I know we've heard of fat freezing when like Jennifer Hudson did it many, many, many years back and she came out and she was skinny and amazing. But I wanted to look for a reputable company in Johannesburg that did fat freezing. So I reached out to my subscribers and I asked them, hey guys, I reached out to my followers on Instagram. And quite a lot of people recommended Young Again Aesthetics and Ravonia. And I obviously reached out to them and I really did want to just work with them. Excuse me, guys. I reached out to them and I kind of let them know what I wanted to do, that I wanted to shoot. And they were really excited they were like actually they would love to like have me on board to do this thing like something similar to the process that i did with dr nandi um the only difference with dr nandi is that there wasn't a fat freezing procedure so i did want to do fat freezing i've looked it up so many times i've seen a lot of people um kind of talk about it and for anybody who doesn't know what fat freezing is fat freezing is when they use this particular machine which basically sucks up your fat and it kind of makes it look like a blob of butter and then after that they kind of massage it um, down and then you pee it out so they suck up your fat they bring up about two layers of fat and then you pee it out of your system but you only start seeing the results within like three to like maybe eight weeks um eight weeks being two months right no I, I think two months is even too long but you do start seeing the results between those time frames so I decided that I would take on this journey with Young Aesthetics, Young Again Aesthetics because I did take on the journey with Dr. Nandi and you guys really enjoyed seeing those um, uh, procedures. I want to start a new journey. I want to help brands. I want to help uncover brands, help discover these kind of procedures. If any of you guys are self-conscious about your bodies but you don't have the financial, um, uh, I guess, financial access this procedure is about four thousand rand if i'm not mistaken per procedure but they do run specials so that's the nice thing they are going to run specials i am going to keep you guys in the loop so that if you guys want to work on your bodies as well that you can do the same thing but before we do that we're going to go to breakfast i really want us to try the spot in hyde park called uh la park apparently it's also another tasha's but like it's like the zhuzhed up version of it i really want to go get breakfast you guys know how much i believe in um taking myself out self-care so i really do want to do that and then we will go to our procedure and then maybe we can grab lunch i don't know how i'll be feeling afterwards but this video is basically centered around that procedure so if you guys want to see about my fat freezing procedure then keep watching you guys won't believe what happened so I found out that my uh, garage battery was flat, right? And because it was flat, I had to open the garage manual. What the? So um, I had to open my garage door because it was flat, right? And I had to open it. I have to open it manually. So when I was leaving, I had to close it. And I put my fingers in between those things, and look what happened. All my fingers, it chewed all my fingers off. Literally, all my nails are gone. I was so stressed like I'm actually in so much shock because it was painful in that moment but then when I just realized that it broke off three of my nails I was like <sighs> so I might make an impromptu run to Tammy Taylor today because I literally cannot walk around with nails that look like this like this is just embarrassing so yes guys I'm gonna head to fat freezing and I'm gonna get my procedure done I'm really looking forward to it but I'm also a little bit scared 
um, because apparently there is some sort of like pain especially with the massaging aspect I've obviously watched a lot of videos trying to understand exactly what I am walking into but before that I'm just gonna go get breakfast I'm gonna go eat so that I don't feel um, dizzy or anything like that because I don't know what to expect in the, in this instance and the lady yesterday Natalie did say I must eat I mustn't kind of you know I must eat and come there prepared and ready for my procedure so I'm gonna go grab a little bit of a quick breaky and then we're gonna head there so yeah guys I'll talk to you as soon as I get to my box. we are finally here at um, La Park so I've never eaten here before but uh, my dad has been here once and my sister has been here my whole family actually has been here not me so I'm gonna try um, the breakfast because you guys know I have another breakfast and I'm gonna let you guys know whether it's worth it or whether y'all need to find another place to go and I'm trying <laughs> One of the things I really like about growing up by myself is that I just get some time to myself. I think within a day, you always need time to just be with you and be like not around a lot of people. Thank you. Not around a lot of people. You just need some dinner. Oh, thanks. It's a lunch place. Sometimes you just need your space. You need to be alone. You need to like be with your thoughts. You need to think. And you can't have a lot of that when you're always around people. You know what I mean? So I think for, for me, I like the idea of being able to come to a restaurant and sit by myself and have my cup of coffee and, you know, just enjoy my time by myself. I don't like the idea of constantly being around people because I talk a lot. So. Let's go to our appointment. Um, so now I'm headed to Avonia and we're gonna go get our fat freezing done. I know I'm just a little bit late, but they did schedule like a two hour kind of gap. So when I do get there, it'll be a situation of like, you know, I still have that 13 minutes. Sanbana. So yeah, guys, I do have some time. Um, I do have a little bit of time. It just felt so weird being stared at. That was weird. That was so awkward. But um, I guess that's what comes with the job, bro. Every job has its cons. Mine, it's this one. So we're gonna go there now. Let me leave High Park, get in the car, head to Ravonia, and we're gonna go do our fat freezing, y'all. <laughs> we'll see y'all when we get there. But I don't have the time, so I'll probably buy it in Ravonia. But, uh, it's fine, let's go guys, let's go. Guys, I'm finally here, but I'm late because of the school. But I'm really hoping I can still squeeze it in for my session. So yeah, here we go, we have me again. Knock, knock. Why didn't you guys tell me that Ravonia Primary gets clogged up like no one's business? Yeah, I forgot about that. Oh, crap. Okay, guys, I'm here. Yeah, yeah, Here's Natalie. La, la. How are you? She's going to be the lady who's doing my fat face today. So, yeah, guys, let me show you what the place looks like. Then we can get started. Nat is going to be the one doing the fat freeze. So Nat, let us know what is the first thing we're going to be doing. So first things first, the proof is not in the pudding. It's right. in the pictures and measurements. We need to 
take pictures of the area we're mm -hmm. gonna freeze mm -hmm. and do measurements as well because that's how we track everything we're doing right okay cool so i need to get undressed obviously yes thanks Nat. Leisure. okay so where is it you want to freeze my tummy stomach how have you gained that you always have to find out like what's your story behind it i think it's the alcohol so i think that with me it's not my eating issues and i also do do mukbangs on youtube so i tend to eat unhealthy because people want to see unhealthy food so take out so the thing with me is that i want to freeze my tummy because i do feel like that is my problem area i work out i've generally got a small waist but i can see that this is some fat i'm struggling to get rid of stubborn fat yeah it is stubborn fat so yeah guys are you going to measure me should i yes <laughs> I'm definitely gonna put the camera down so guys um, I'm laying down on the bed and this is what it looks like oh my gosh my tummy looks so nice from aerial view because it's like when in actual fact it's okay, just showing the machine okay so, so this is the machine see, this is a medical cool tech cocoon machine I've seen so, this on YouTube yes there's a lot of like conventional mm. startup businesses that's doing fat freezing, yeah. but they're not going to get results. Okay. Only the cool tech medical machines get the results. That's what we give clients because oh. other machines only freezes for half an hour or an hour, mm. but not on the temperature this freezes. You can't freeze mm. with any machine on minus mm. eight, you'll get frostbite directly. Oh my goodness. Okay. okay. Yeah, I have noticed that even with the other um, uh, brands that my friends suggested they don't use the cool tech, it's only Ravonia that uses cool tech. So, yeah, guys, and I've seen Americans use cool tech. So, and cool tech is FDA approved. Oh, FDA, FDA approved. So, it's yeah. not something bought from China, it's FDA a approved. approved. Okay, see, I'm not gonna die, guys. See, okay, guys, um, well, I'm gonna show you guys the process and we're gonna get started. I'm so nervous. No, so it doesn't hurt. You can explain everything to them as we okay. start. So the first thing she's going to do is apply the gel pack, right? The gel pack, And yes. this is what it looks so like. So this is the gel pack, mm -hmm. which is going to, it's going to feel cold when I apply it. But Ooh. this helps to protect your skin and numb your skin. Oh. Literally to feel nothing while we're freezing. So maybe for the first five to ten minutes, mm -hmm. you might feel the suction, which yeah. is something you're not yeah. used to. Obviously. And then, boom, nothing. Zilch, nada. Entertaining the audience here. Yeah. Oh, wow. Okay, I'm really, I'm really excited, guys, because you guys know how long I've been struggling with my fupa. So, um, I'm really looking forward to seeing the results. And I definitely will be doing more than one session. And it is a non-invasive. So, if any of you are very afraid to do, like, go under the knife, I think fat freezing is a brilliant concept. So... I just want to see if it's going to work on me. Apparently it is, guys. Apparently it is. Okay. And there's no downtime. Like, yes. not going to struggle to go home. Yeah, you're not. So you're, you're going to be able to walk. You're going to be fine. You can literally let them know how you feel tomorrow. You can... Yeah, yeah. You can... Okay, guys. Know. I'm definitely going to let you guys know how I feel tomorrow. But, okay, let's let Nat do her thing. Let's do the first one. Oh, my gosh. Okay. Are you ready? Okay. Can literally see how the gel pad uh -huh. goes in. Oh wow! Yeah, just Especially it's like a suction side. feeling. Oh, and it's so tight it can't fall off. Oh my goodness, Nat, please get my my iPhone so I can also do this on Instagram. Okay, let me. Do you want me to get it before applying this one? Yes. feel like this boom okay and there we go that is fat freezing okay how does it feel it literally just feels like two things tugging onto my food but it's nothing no i'm not feeling anything yet it's I better just, than exercise it then 10 i would drive to ravona every day if i could do this every week i would okay so i just feel like a pulling a sensation it does i don't know if i'm feeling cold or i'm just feeling like a tingly 
So it monitors Nami. your skin. So over here it's 10 degrees. Over right. here it's already on minus one. So the numbing still hasn't kicked in. It's only been two minutes. That's why I said give it about five to okay. ten minutes. Some people will sense it again, mostly ten minutes. But you'll feel a bit of a tingly. Boom, nothing. Okay guys, so I'm gonna wait for it to hit minus one. I'm gonna talk to you guys just now. Maybe minus eight. Oh, minus eight, there we go. Uh, I'm gonna talk to you guys as soon as it gets to that point. Let me just take some Instagram stories so people can see on my Instagram and look forward to this vlog. Okay, I'll talk to you guys just now. Okay guys, so um, it has reached minus eight on this side. And on the other side, it's also minus eight. So, so far, I am feeling nothing really it just feels like a tugging sensation um i'm not really feeling any weird cold feeling nothing it's literally just the two little blobs here just tugging at my skin so i'm just gonna sit throughout this procedure and then i will talk to you guys as soon as i'm done when that shows us what she does afterwards so i'll see you guys in about you want me to quickly show you all temperature and stuff on here sure do you want to show them let me switch this for you so you can actually show them what it looks like. Oh, me too. Oh. So you can look there. <laughs> yeah, thank you. Not a camera person. So is it zero one minus eight for both? Minus of them? eight, both of them, and the one has fifty three more minutes. The other one fifty four. Okay, perfect. So we'll see you guys in fifty four minutes. Bye. Hey guys. Um. So it has officially been fifty fifty three an minutes. Hour? It's literally been an hour. Yeah, it's been an hour since I've been sitting. So far, no pain. Everything has been absolutely great. Now Nat is going to take it off so that you guys can see what it looks like. I also need my phone so that Instagram can see what it looks like because you guys know I got to do my job twice as hard. Bro. But, okay, Nat, are we ready? Yes. We I, I, I need this on camera. I definitely Perfect. need this on camera. Okay. Guys? Getting to the first one. Oh. Uh. <gasps> oh my god. <gasps> what the ultimate? <gasps> I have to take a picture. I have to take a video of this. Oh my and the god. Other side. Okay. Oh my goodness. Guys, I am shook. Please have a look at that. That's all my fat right over there. So so she can't feel it yet. I can't feel anything. It's going to feel a bit of tender now. Okay, because yeah. it's your tender. Yeah. Mm, it, does. it is ice cold. So what I need to do is, as you can see, I'm massaging mm -hmm. the fat cells back to its place as it pulled it all up. Okay. So this is always a bit tender. Yeah, I feel that. But we just need to get it back in the place because you're feel... not going to walk out with blocks. <laughs> yeah, I couldn't feel my stomach at all. This is the only part I'm feeling because it's actually coming back to me that oh crap. The then fat all went What I want to do, I want to take this off, then I want you to literally, I'm going to wipe it first to clean off the gel, and then okay. I want you to touch and feel the minus eight. Oh my goodness. This is... Guys, I just want to show you from an aerial view, like, this is essentially what's happening right now. So this is the one side of my tummy and that is the other side. Okay, you ready? Okay, I'm just gonna wipe it off. Okay, I actually, I can't, I can't feel anything. Yes, cause you are numb. So take your hands and place it down when we froze. I'm terrified. <gasps> it's so cold. <gasps> it is so cold. <laughs> <laughs> yes. How did I not feel that cold? Exactly, you were numb. What made me numb? The child pack? Yeah. My tummy is literally frozen like ice, guys. It is frozen. <laughs> oh my goodness. Yeah, even when you rub me, it feels like I can't feel what exactly you're rubbing. Okay, I can feel that. Okay, Sorry, thanks, I Nat. <laughs> <laughs> okay wow my tummy was so cold i'm actually in disbelief oh my goodness okay 
But how's it feeling? No, it's not so bad. It feels like, you know, when you're numb and people try to bring that feeling back into you, it's not too uncomfortable for me. It's just like an uncomfortable, like, I feel like someone's playing on my tummy. Yes. But not too much pain, no. And you don't have kids yet to play no. with your stomach. Oh my gosh, please, I don't want kids to play with my stomach now. Perfect. Wow, go. guys, there we have it. Oh my goodness. Okay, guys, so we are done with the procedure. Let me not waste Nat's time because she does have a lot of clients. I will talk to you guys as soon as I get in the car. Hi, everyone, and welcome back. Um, it's been a few days. I think just a little, just about a week now since I've done the procedure, and I thought that obviously I wanted to have like a quick chit chat with you guys, sit down, tell you how I've been feeling over the past few days. I am currently having my detox tea with my Le Creset mug that I got from one of my good friends, Lungelo. Um, you guys probably know him. He's Lungelo KM on Twitter. Like, he's just... <laughs> blah, 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 blah. But anyway, Lungelo got me this amazing Le Creset mug and in my favorite color. Well, my favorite color is black, but this was my favorite color when, like, growing up the whole time. But anyway... Um, I am having this tea tox that I got from a uh, young again aesthetics. It actually looks like this I've generally been doing all the Kind of things that they told me to do after the fat freezing. So drinking the 2.5 liters of water I've actually been cheating that quite a bit um, I was told not to drink alcohol after 48 hours well for 48 hours after the procedure or like for 24 so the past few days were quite interesting in terms of how i felt afterwards after the whole massaging of the tummy i did feel bloated for about two days after that um i felt bloated and my tummy still felt quite tender and quite numb so sleeping wasn't really an issue um everything was fairly okay but i still could feel that when i tried to feel parts of my tummy parts of my tummy were feeling a little bit um numb and it was still a bit swollen so it was looking kind of very bloated it was kind of really hard to suck my tummy in and then when the numbing kind of slowly went down that's when the pain kicked in um it wasn't like an intense awful pain but there was one night where i tried to sleep and i felt like instead of normally feeling like when i can turn on my tummy which is something i really ever do i try to sleep on my one side and i felt like oh i i felt sorry guys i actually got a call from my plumber because i'm having a bit of an issue with my washing machine so i think the first two days uh my tummy still felt a bit tender and numb but then that obviously went away and when it did i did experience just a little bit of the after effects of like a place that has been numb for quite some time your senses start come kind of coming back and then you start you start to feel that pain just a little bit but it was nothing uncomfortable i think it was just for a day or two where i felt the pain um just when it involved kind of turning around sharply so if i was sleeping in bed and i turned around sharply i would feel that pain or if i kind of just put a lot of pressure on my tummy so for example <clears throat> wearing tight clothing wearing a belt i felt uncomfortable but again it was nothing um that was too unbearable you know um to be really honest, uh, I am really excited to see what the results are going to be. I know obviously that I'm not going to see any results within like the first two weeks. Um, I'm only going to see results from three weeks up until eight weeks as they said. So I'm really excited to see that. I'm looking forward to it and I do want to obviously go to Young Again um, Aesthetics. I do want to work on my arms because you guys know how I feel about like this fat under my arms. Like my family and I, we just have this really horrible thing of just having arm fat like i've tried i've tried to figure out like why i can't get rid of this at the gym because i'm fairly someone i'm someone who's actually a little bit overweight i'm supposed to be weighing in like my 60s and 60 kilograms and i actually weigh about 70 three four so i'm really 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 just working on dropping all that weight um, I've become so obsessed with uh, weight loss. I told myself that, you know, one of the most difficult things for me when it came to um, the journey was like the discipline of eating and, and things like that. Like I know that I lacked discipline. Growing up a lot, I've lacked discipline. But normally when I do put my mind to something, I end up being able to do it. Now, one of the things that has proven to me that I do have that resilience was with my YouTube channel. Um, 
there was a point where I really wanted to give up on it. I wasn't serious. I didn't really care about it. it. Didn't really mean anything. But when I started realizing how much that channel meant to me, that is when I started actively putting in the work, and I saw the results after some time. So. With weight loss, it's, it's, it can be very demotivating at times, and I know that we always want like a quick fix. But I do realize that even the people who train a lot and things like that, we all have stubborn weight. We all have um, some sort of body dysmorphia, and that's okay. So this year, I think it's really just working on my body. Like, there's a lot of things I don't talk about. So, for example, the fact that I've been kind of exposed to a whole lot of things, whereas like TV and stuff like that, it's made my body dysmorphia even worse. Like I am so self-conscious, it's ridiculous. And it's probably because now a lot of eyes are on you and you're just feeling like, oh my God, I don't look like all these people that I really love and follow on social media. So now you want to drop all that weight. So, uh, sorry guys, I know that I gave you guys a ton of information, like two seconds. But yeah, I've gotten to a point in my life where I just want to focus on my health. I just want to be healthy. I just want to lose weight. I just want to have my ideal body that I've wanted. I know that, yes, I I really appreciate the comments about me having a great body. But I think this body dysmorphia is something that I need to work on for myself. It's something that I want to work on for like my image. It's something that I feel matters to me. So I really, really, really do want to work on that. And I'm really hoping to see the results. So yeah, guys, if you guys have any words of encouragement, any diet recipes I can try. I even bought a new uh, blender, actually, that I should probably show you guys before this video ends. I bought a new blender. It's called the Bennett Reed. Uh, Bennett Red or Bennett Reed. I'm not sure how you pronounce it. But it's this brand new blender that I bought for like smoothies and shakes. But the thing that I like about it is that it's kind of like a portable water bottle. Let me just get it so I can show you guys what it looks like. So this is what it looks like guys it's called the bennett reed or like the bennett red i don't know if you guys will be able to see that i actually tweeted about this um about a day or two ago about how much i am so excited to use this i've used it on one smoothie and it worked really really well and the nice thing about it is that when you actually disconnect it it becomes a water bottle so i'm really looking forward to making more smoothies like i've noticed that i'm someone um oh, there we go for someone who actually does lots of mukbangs and stuff, but with mukbangs it's different because I actually stop myself from eating all day so that I actually have the appetite to eat my food on camera. But I've noticed that I'm someone who generally doesn't eat in the morning and stuff like that. So I want to get into the habit of making smoothies. I want to get into the habit of routine, gym, um, working from home can kind of, you know, make you very lazy. So I just really want to work on myself, work on my body. And I really hope you guys support me in the journey because it's been extremely difficult watching myself kind of let myself go. Um, it's been a lot to take in. But I'm really happy that I have this channel. I have my family, my fave gang. You guys are my family. And I know you guys will definitely lead me about the right path. So without rambling too much, I know I have. This is the end of this vlog. Let me know in the comments what you think of fat freezing. Definitely show Young, um, young Again Aesthetics some love. They are based in Livonia. Um, and what I love about them is that they are using products that are FDA approved. For anybody who was wondering about that information. So yeah guys. I love you guys so much and this is the end of this vlog. And I will see you guys in my next one.